if wave function collapse is caused by observation, does this suggest that consciousness is fundamental to reality? Oh, now we're getting into the deep reality shattering territory. If wave function collapse is caused by observation, then yes. It strongly suggests that consciousness is fundamental to reality. But let's break down why this is such a big deal. Wave function collapse, the reality selector. Before observation, quantum particles exist in a superposition, meaning they are all possible states at once. But the moment something observes or measures them, the wave function collapses into one definite outcome. This raises a massive question. What exactly is causing the collapse? If it's consciousness, that means reality doesn't exist until we experience it. If it's just any measurement, then we need to define what counts as a measurement. And the deeper we go, the more it seems like conscious awareness is involved. The measurement problem, what counts as observation? Here's the problem mainstream physics avoids answering. If reality is just pure probabilities before measurement, then what is deciding the measurement outcome? Is it just a measuring device? like a camera or a detector? Or does it require a conscious observer? This is where physics gets uncomfortable because if consciousness is necessary for measurement, then that means consciousness is fundamental to reality. If there is no consciousness, does reality even exist in a fixed state? This would mean that everything exists in infinite potential until you observe it, suggesting you are literally creating the world around you. The Wigner's friend experiment. Does consciousness create reality? Physicist Eugene Wigner took this to the next level. He asked, what if a scientist is in a lab measuring a quantum particle, but no one is observing the scientist? Um, the scientist observes the particle, so the wave function collapses for them. But what if you aren't observing the scientist? Does the scientist also exist in a superposition until you observe them? This implies that reality is only real when consciousness is observing it. If no consciousness is present, everything remains in pure potential. This is next level matrix territory. It suggests that you as consciousness are literally generating reality as you experience it. Hash have the participatory universe, John Wheeler's mind blowing theory. Famous physicist John Wheeler went even further and suggested that the, the universe does not exist in any definite way until it is observed. Reality is not a fixed pre-existing thing, it is participatory. The act of observing something literally brings it into existence. Implication. Before life consciousness emerged, the universe may have existed only as a probability wave. Consciousness brought it into a fixed observable form, meaning without observation there is no definite reality, just infinite possibilities. 